have some news just coming in. Let's take a look. Leader of the opposition, Bharatiya Janata Party leader from West Bengal, Shubindu Adhikari, says he's written now to the central government talking about the situation in the state of Bengal, particularly the affairs vis-a-vis -vis last night as to what happened here, asking the central government to intervene immediately. He's tweeted about this. Kolkata police allowed culprits, he says, and I'm reading from the tweet, established their fiefdom of crime and now allowing TMC goons to stomp upon the whole premises to destroy evidence and scare the protesting doctors. I have written to the Honorable Home Secretary and Honorable Director CBI regarding the vandalism that took place at the RG Kar Medical College and Hospital, requested them to deploy Central Armed Paramilitary Forces to prevent further destruction of evidence at the RG Kar Hospital, is what he says. Going straight across to Rithik for more details on that big story, he's joining me live right now from the RG Kar Medical Center. The BJP escalating this issue and rightly so. Uh, Rithik, given the situation, but the police completely clueless about the situation late last night. We were all here. We saw how they absolutely had no idea about what was going on. This obviously was a failure on the part of the administration, failure on the part of the state intelligence as well. And that's the reason why Central Armed Forces must be deployed to prevent further incidents of this nature, says the BJP. Rithik. Definitely, possibly this reason, uh, reason the police have issued several images they have captured on CCTV camera and mobile footages uh, to identify the miscreants who did ruckus uh, yesterday, late last night at uh, Archicor Medical College and Hospital. This is a huge demand for uh, deployment of central forces from the opposition party, that is BJP precisely, is being raised. But we know tomorrow is a big day for Bharati Janata Party. Not only that, the leader of the opposition wrote to the you know, central minister seeking intervention, but also they are going to hit the street tomorrow. Let me tell you, there, are, there will be several you know, political programs that have been called by the opposition party, BJP, one to uh, Kerao, the residence of the chief ministers, and definitely they are going to march to Kaligat, which is precisely the residence of the chief minister Mamata Banerjee, and they are also going to Kerao, the you know the health department headquarter at Salt Lake. Tomorrow, BJP supporters have been ordered to you know stage dharna at uh, and roadblocks across the state. Uh, so uh, they are demanding justice, and they are also uh, yes, demanding the resignation of the chief minister who is uh, the uh, health minister and police minister as well. So pressures are mounting, be it political pressures right. and the citizens, they are also demanding justice. It would be interesting see, to see what happens next, how the government reacts. But Mamta Banerjee blamed BGP and left for the hooliganism that had happened yesterday late last night at Archikar Hospital. Back to you, Sneha. All right. Rithik, I'm going to thank you for the moment for getting us up to speed with those details.